Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Sons of the Forest. Today we're showing you how to get the shovel, the wetsuit, the slingshot, and the weapon flashlight. You can throw on any of your weapons with a rail on it. So first you want to look at this mountain. That's a good point of interest. You can look right below it. You're going to see a couple of caves right where three of the streams meet. They're going to be a small cave here. I'll zoom in for you. I also put a picture on the video for you. Oh, we got some friends. All right, so you will see these three guys here. The one in the middle will have a slingshot on him. You can just grab that real quick. Then we'll head over here to the cave. All right, once you get into the cave, you're going to want to make sure you have a flashlight at least so you can see a little bit. You will also need the rope gun and the rebreather. If you haven't gotten those yet, check out my last video. You can take a look at how to get those. Head on the zip line. There is a air canister over here next to this light if you need it. Then you can hop right into the water. Head down towards the middle. There is a small hole. Once you get into there, you're going to do a 180 and head this direction. Now you should be coming up to the surface. Be careful. There is a few guys over here waiting for you. Um, hopefully you have a strong weapon and or some explosives. All right, after those guys are down, you'll see here is the wetsuit. Looks like a pair of flippers, another oxygen tank, and some ammo. We'll head straight this way. All right, now you'll see this little spot here, a little bit of a water slide. Just walk right on that, and that will send you right down. All right, then once you drop into the water here, you're going to want to do another 180 and head this way towards all the luggage. All right, then once you get out to here, you'll see some more enemies. Then you're going to see this guy hanging out right here. There's a few more tanks, another luggage. And then you're going to see this area over here to the left. You veer off a little bit. You can jump right through this. This will take you to the direction that we need to go. There's another water hole as well as some loot and grenades and another tank and luggage. Loot that up. You may need that. Then you hop into the water here. Now first, once you get to this area, when it splits off, you're going to make sure you take a left. We will go to the right after all right, and then once you surface here, there's going to be a few more guys waiting for you. So definitely be careful, get prepared for them. If you have some explosives, those are good. Now also, don't forget to skin all the enemies. Then you can use their armor as protection, as well as if you get overwhelmed, they cannot swim, so you can hop right into the water. All right, head this way. You're going to veer to the right. Another passageway this way. You'll see some light in the distance. You may want to get a grenade or two ready. There should be some... Uh, Double-legged, double-creature things over here, the twins. Give them a little grenade or two. All right, then after you take those guys out, there's a few babies, and there is the shovel. You got the shovel. Now you're ready to go and do some of the dig sites. All right, after that, turn back around, head the way you came. And then once you get to this section here, this time you're going to go to the left. There's a few crates here and there. This guy's got some ammo on him. You're going to head towards the middle. Watch out, there's a few more mutants. And you're going to see this guy hanging out. He has the weapon flashlight that you can use. After you get that, you can head back here to the right corner. You'll see some of this gold on the wall. Head this way, and this is the exit. And then once you get to this area, you can make a left. This wall sometimes opens, and you can use an explosive here to do a shortcut. And there is the exit, boys. So now you have the shovel, you got the wetsuit, and the weapon flashlight. Hopefully you made it through without dying. If anything, you can place little shelters and save and respawn throughout there. Now don't forget, we have a whole playlist on how to get all these items. So if you don't have one of the items here or there, then you can check out that playlist and that will help you get everything. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video.